Okay, so what we're looking at now is the free body diagram of a plane in flight, as well as the um, shear force diagram, bending moment diagram of a plane in flight. The syllabus asks you to understand bending stresses. It asks you to understand the effect of a uniformly distributed load on a shear force and a bending moment diagram. So, this is actually a non-uniformly distributed load because if you have a look at the plane in plan view, there it is. Let's make it a little bit more aerodynamic. The wings are thicker at the base than they are at the tip, which means that produces a lot more lift than at the tip which is what I've drawn here. So, the shear force diagram, as you know, shear force diagram of a uniformly distributed load is a diagonal line. When we hit the point load, it follows the point load as well. Hit the engine, hit the engine, comes there and it's rotational symmetry about that point. The bending moment diagram, I'll draw in red. See if I can spell in red as well. Bending moment diagram is essentially a parabola or a series of parabolae. The change in flexion point each time you hit a um, point load.